The second exercise, quarter squat and up on toes, push press. So behind the head, of course. So what you do, always your center of gravity, you settle between your balls of your feet, not on your toes and your heels, right? You are sitting down on a chair. So don't push your hip forward. I told you in the class, this is dirty dance. So please back on your heels, okay? Pick up the bars, set behind the head. Okay, dog. And then so quarter squat and up on toes push press. And always settle back on your trapezius. Get the comfortable grip and do it. Looking straight ahead, don't look up, don't look down, straight ahead. Very good. Okay, good job. Grip it in your hand. Hector, always grip it in your hand. Don't release your fingers. So, we did straight knees, overhead press. We did quarter squat and up on toes, of course. Push press. And then we did the third version behind the head. Squat, push and press, okay? So pick out the barbells, set behind the head. Always has to be a comfortable grip. So not necessarily medium grip, could be wider, has to be very comfortable for your shoulders, okay? And 10 times squat, push press, and up on toes, and go. Deep squat, and fast up, and always hold on your toes a little bit. Yes, keep going. Put it down and rest. So remember, I was teaching in the class the good morning, behind the head, good morning exercise. So you don't look down like in front of an emperor, you look up this time. So you do exactly same movement, but pressure on your hamstring, nothing on your quadriceps, okay? And always no any pressure on your toes. So your toes must be free in your shoe. So always to balance toward to your heels from your balls of your feet, looking up, arching your back, not curbing. This is curbing, this one is arching. So looking up, imagine someone would hit your middle back and you do this movement, right? So put the bar behind the head and you lean forward as much you feel comfortable all the way down to feel the big pressure in your hamstring and up, when you come up, you don't push your hip forward, just up to the same level on vertical line. And do it 10 times, good morning. Looking up, Michael, arch your back. Arch your back, and up and down, right. 10 times, looking up, yes. This is the regular good morning. Yes. 10 times, and then put the bar down. Great. So, the bent over rows with barbell is much easier to hold the straight line alignment of your fist, of your elbows, of your shoulder, and the bar, because the bar is straight, right? So you pick up medium grip, and wait a second. And then when you bend over, same principle like you did before, back on your heels to feel the pressure on your hamstring. You don't need to hold your back straight. You can curve your back just to be sure that your shoulders are lower than your, than your hip. So bend over, and then when you pull up your fist, your elbow, the bar must be on same perfect line alignment, okay, in this way, up and down. So pick up the waist, please, and then bend over, yes, and do it 10 times, bent over rows. Elbows forward, elbows forward, elbows forward, right, when you pull up, up there. Bend your knees a little bit, flex your knees, don't keep it straight, your knees. Right, good. 
Ok. Great job. Now we go to practice the first complex exercise that I developed in the world between 1968 and 1971. That was my time of experimenting this exercise. And you learned already, and today we practice together. So what is the first exercise from barbell complex one? Upright rows. Upright rows. And then you follow with? And then? Squat push press, then good morning, then bent over rows, and high pull snatch, okay? So you need to memorize, you have the posters also, and we do first practicing the first three exercises, okay? So pick up the barbells, please, and we do six times upright rows, six high pull snatch, six uh, squat push press behind the head. So attention, we go together and six upright rows and go, one, and two, and up on toes, three, elbows higher, four, five, and six, and high pull snatch, and go slow and fast up, one, and two, and three, don't rush it, and four, and five, and six, and overhead, squat push press, and go, and one, and two, come on, and three, and four, and five, and six. Put it down and rest. So what is the most important? The proper technique, because remember that is no dangerous exercise, just dangerous technique, okay? So please, very important. Don't rush it, don't do it too heavy weight and then memorize to be sure that you are flawless. So after you finish the high pull snatch, be sure that you remember that it comes from here, the squat push press. So don't let your arms down, wasting energy and cutting off your rhythm. So from here, just behind the head, the squat push press, the good mornings, then take very fast up, the bent over rows, and finish with the high pull snatch. So pick up the weights, please. Meet two wide grip, right, in front of your chest. We do the full set of barbell complex one. Attention, and we go. Six upright rows, one, two, three, elbows up, four, close to you, and six, and high pull snatch, and go, and one, and two, and three, and four, come on guys, and five, and six, and behind the head squat, push press, and go, and one, and two, and up on toes, and three, and four, all the way down, Moody, five, and six, and good morning, good morning, majesty, and go, and one, feel on your hamstring, the big pressure, looking up, looking up, yes, come on, Six times, yes, and then in front of you, bent over rows, and go elbows, elbows, Hector, same level with your shoulders, same level with your shoulders. Come on, pull up, keep going, here. And then high pull snatch, and go. Great job. Okay, put the bar down. Great job. So now, we will set the barbells back. Remember, holding up on vertical line not to hurt someone. Put back on the right place, and then we pick up the dumbbells for the dumbbell complex one. And go. Okay. 